Cindy. So back at her live with me this morning, I have Michael with the Rag Collection. Good morning to you. Good morning. So you are going to be down here next Saturday. Tell me what you're going to be doing, first of all. So our organization is called the Rag Collection. Um, we have a program at Alhambra High School called Raise Your Voice. Um, and those students are coming down to um, the gallery here, and we're going to be doing uh, spoken word poetry. Uh, they'll be showcasing some of their visual art, and they're going to be doing live a mural in which the, they have invited the community to come out and help them create. So is this something they'll be painting? They will be using paint and spray paint. So tell me a little bit about the RAG Collection. What is this organization? So we're an arts nonprofit who um, we take or provide art resources to the youth in our community, um, and we encourage them to speak up about issues that um, they feel passionate about. Um, a lot of the students are really just in need of safe space and self-expression, um, and they just really want to be heard, and a lot of them don't have the resources uh, to be heard. So. so you guys will go into classrooms and basically let them draw or paint or whatever the case may be? So we do after-school workshops, uh, weekly workshops. Um, we have uh, a mural crew workshop, which we do graffiti and mural arts. We do uh, photo voice, which is mixed media and photography, and we do... Uh, those are our current workshops. Um, we're always looking to expand and uh, yeah. And so you use art as a way of therapy. Exactly. And so you're also in a women's shelter, is that correct? Uh, yes, we are. Uh, we have a program called Beautiful Voices, which is held at Streetlight USA. And, and what's that? Uh, Streetlight USA is a shelter for women coming out of sex trafficking. Why is this something that you're involved in personally? Um, I just believe that the youth in our community are, they're they're our next generation, they're our future, um, and uh, they just need an outlet and they need to be heard and uh, they need to be empowered to uh, engage their community and, and make changes. Very quickly, tell me about the pieces on this table. Um, so this piece here is uh, currently one that they're working on. Um, the past few weeks we've been talking a lot about hope. Um, so they're collaborating on this piece. Uh, it's in the work, so it's not finished yet. Uh, this piece here was done by a student. Um, we asked the question if you were a house, um, or to draw yourself as a house, essentially. Mm -hmm. um, and she did that in, in about 30 minutes. And wow. um, this was cool because I didn't actually know that she could draw, so. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, so for more information, if folks want to get in touch with you, they want you guys um, to help spearhead a program for their organization. They can contact us on our website. It's the RAG, R-A-G collection.org mm -hmm. um, or they can find us on Facebook for our collection. Michael, so great meeting you. Again, thank you so much. Uh, if you would like to learn more about Michael and the RAG Collection, you can come down here to the Street Festival uh, on Grand Avenue, Avenue next Saturday. Uh, this is going to be in downtown Phoenix. Huge street fair with lots of artists, food vendors, entertainment, and so much more. I'll send it back to you, Jamie. Looks like fun.